Good afternoon, I'm John Perkins at the Closing Market Minute. Soybeans finished solidly higher on Wednesday. Outside of some updated weather forecasts for more rain and cooler temperatures in parts of the Midwest and Plains, there really isn't anything fundamentally bullish for beans right now. But with only 60% of the crop planted, that leaves tens of millions of acres currently unplanted. So there are definitely some concerns about prevent plant acres even for beans this year. Corn ended the session mixed, consolidating after Tuesday's post-USDA report jump. Wheat was mixed. Chicago and Kansas City were up, expecting more planning delays in parts of the plains, along with continued quality concerns for both hard and soft red winter. Minneapolis, though, was down, expecting a pretty rapid end to this year's spring wheat planting. The USDA's weekly export sales numbers are out on Thursday at 8.30 a.m. Eastern, 7.30 Central. Live and feeder cattle were lower ahead of this week's widespread direct cash cattle business. Some light trade was reported in parts of the north by early Wednesday afternoon, but most of the major feeding areas were still quiet. And hogs ended the session mixed, mostly lower on spread adjustments, some commercial pressure, and spillover from cattle. Demand uncertainty is also a factor there as well. I'm John Perkins with the Closing Market Minute.